Captured doodle bugs or Nazi midget demolition tanks. This space is loaded with explosives. The tank is run with batteries. A doodle bug operated by remote control. Salvaging enemy rifles captured on the Normandy front. The city of Valogne, a heap of rubble following its capture 20th June by Americans advancing toward Cherbourg. Engineers clear a route through the city for military traffic, demolishing all dangerous buildings. The battle-scarred railroad station at Lison as American engineers, aided by Frenchmen, repair the yards. Most of the equipment was wrecked by American bombs while Lison was still in German hands. A rocket carrying P-47 crashes and burns on a new landing strip in the Cherbourg Peninsula. Men of the 9th Air Force extinguish the flames to prevent rockets from exploding. The rockets were removed intact. The 207th and 300th engineers at Carentan try to save a slowly sinking wooden bridge spanning a stream. Captured enemy cement is used for the foundations. Later, it was found necessary to supplant the structure with a Bailey Bridge. Engineers suffered many casualties from enemy shells during the period of construction, but the work continued uninterrupted. Widening the river channel to relieve pressure. The 128th Evacuation Hospital sets up quarters on the Normandy coast. A container of whole blood arrives after being flown here by glider from England. The x-ray tent. 90% of the casualties are brought here first for examination. Showing typical injuries. Putting an injured soldier in a plaster cast. Plasma is given to a wounded German. Sherman tanks of the British 29th Armored Brigade prepare to advance 28th June from north of the Surrey River to encircle German positions at Caen.
light equipment following the tanks kept to heavily wooded areas. The terrain offers good cover for the advancing infantry. Massing for the attack. Tanks encounter strong enemy resistance about seven miles southwest of the center of Kham. Nazis employed tanks and anti-tank guns in a vain attempt to stem the advance. An enemy plane tries to break up the formation of tanks. A Sherman tank receives a direct hit from an anti-tank gun. until the 28th June, more than 100 German tanks were destroyed in this sector. British losses were comparatively light. First Infantry Patrol entering the outskirts of Kham. Youthful prisoners are removed to the rear. Captured German officers. 